YouTube. What's good, man? You already know who it is. It's your boy, Keese. Sad part about the red pill is that not everyone's going to understand you. You're alone. You know, uh, you'll have people judge you incorrectly. You know what I'm saying? Judge your character as a person. When in reality, they just don't understand. And what you got to understand, right? You being red pill, what you have to understand is that you had to understand their point of view. Look at where they at. Because you had the same eyes as them. Right? You used to be blue pill. You understand that you know, they're in the matrix, they're in the prison. They're in that prison. So you understand that, okay. You gotta let them experience things. You get what I'm saying? That's the only way, that is the only way you're gonna get through anyone's head. Is by them experiencing it. You know, it doesn't matter how many times you tell your boy, oh yeah, you know, uh, she, she ain't right, bro. I'm trying to tell you. If you don't do this, she's gonna do that. It doesn't matter if, how many times you could tell him. Because not, listen, most people just can't learn from other people's mistakes. You gotta understand that. They gotta learn on their own. So you gotta let them, you gotta let motherfuckers do what they gotta do. Whether it's gonna hurt them, it, it, hey, listen, if it hurt him, it hurt him. But it might it, it might wake him up. You know, and of course, we want to prevent these things from happening, you know, t to the people that we love. But you just got to let the most high play it out, bro. And that's just the truth. You know, another sad truth is that people will judge you. Because... You know the truth. People would, people would judge you because you're telling the truth. Because nowadays in this society, the truth, can, it shouldn't be revealed. The truth is blasphemous. The truth is hurtful. It's not reality anymore. <laughs> When in reality, the truth is inevitable because everyone has to look in this mirror. Everyone has to look in this mirror and look at themselves in the morning and at night before they go to sleep and deal with it. But see, you know, a lot of motherfuckers, you know, I like, guess what? A lot of motherfuckers, they, they try to find things to cope with. They try to find all these coping mechanisms. So that the truth won't hit them. Because they can't handle it. See, when you smart, when you know shit, you understand the truth makes you better. You understand taking accountability will improve your life overall. Not running away from it. You don't run away from it. Because guess what? It's going to make you worse. It's going to make you a worse individual than who you are already. But it's up to you. It's up to you to make that change. It's up to you to guide yourself through the pain, through the sorrow, through the madness. Whether you alone or not. You understand the bigger picture when you're red pill. And... Women, on the other hand, they might call you misogynist. They might call you, you know, uh, can't say the word, but the G word. They might call you that. They might, they might call you some other, some other names. They might say you hate women. Listen, you got to understand this. Most women, they can't cope with themselves. Most women, they want to hear the good things. They want to hear. They want to hear those things. They don't want to hear the accountability shit. They don't want to hear none of that. Now, 
and you got some women, right? You got some women who are truthful. Don't get me wrong. I'm not saying all women. You got some women, which is rare. But best believe most women, they're in that, in that programming mechanism. They're in that stimulation. Even though, right, those those are the kinds of women that, that aren't even moral. You know what I'm saying? Because they, they want you to be morally correct. But their actions aren't moral. But you know, you got to play the game. You got to act like it. You got to adapt. You got to have it in your mind that, oh, she's a good person. She's innocent. She never did anything wrong in her life. Deep down, she done did a lot of dirt. But want to play this moral code. They want to. They want to be this politically correct all the time. You know what I'm saying? They, this is what. This is what they want to do now. They want to act like it. Act positive. And when they're not, you know, uh, you might. You might even cut some of your friends off, dog. Because they're not doing anything around you to even try to improve their life, and they just. They just dragging you down with them. You might, you might have to cut some off because no cap, I had to. I had to cut one of my best friends off, man. One of my best friends, man. Cool, bro. To this day, man, he still listen. To this day, I still got love for him, but I had to do it, man. Why? Cause all you want to do is smoke. All you want to do is smoke. Be sad. Right, play the game all day. That's all you want to do. How are we gonna get this money? How are we gonna improve our life? How are we gonna get? How are we gonna get fit? How are we gonna improve our minds? That's who you should be hanging out with. Not motherfuckers who content, who stagnant all day, who want to be sad all day, and not do nothing about it. Instead, find a group that's just like you, that want to improve the quality of life. I want to get their fair share with women. I want to have fun. But guess what? The sacrifice comes before the fun. And they know that too. But see, it all starts with you. You want you want to be around that group. It starts with you, fam. It starts with you. Because the energy exists, man. Trust and believe that, man. The energy that you put out to this universe exists, dog. When you put out that kind of energy, guess what? It all comes back to you. It all comes back. You get a reward from that. But see, what you don't get a reward for is complaining, right? Doing the same shit you did yesterday, sitting around, not doing shit, not collecting money, not doing nothing with your life, right? Wasting gallons of milk on yourself, right? You ain't gonna improve shit doing that dumb ass shit. Are you? What are you gonna improve doing that? All you're, all you're doing is improving your, to, your uh, depression. That's all you're doing. That's all you're doing. You're making yourself more and more lazier or every single day, spilling gallons everywhere. That's all you doing. Lying to yourself. That's all you doing, fam. And that's why most people, most people are average. That's why. Because they can't handle the truth. They can't come to this mirror and be like, listen, I'm gonna stop doing this. I got to. I gotta take accountability, man. They can't do that. It takes sacrifice. It takes it takes the blame, man. For real. Because what it is is, man, your mind is hardwired to be comfortable. When you when you're comfortable, it's like, okay, well, I, I'm safe. I don't fear anything because I know that I'm I'm getting a check next week. I know that I, I'm I'm living with my mom, so my mom got me. So your mind is being safe, but what you're not understanding is. That is a detriment to your life. 
That is why you're not improving your life because you want to be safe. When instead you should go against your fears as a man. And when you do that, then overall your ultimate self will transform. And I'm gonna just leave the video with this, man. Understand this. See, Andrew Tate has been banned from the socials. And you gotta understand this, man. They will put a bad name on you when you're telling the truth. When you have conviction it under your, you know, under your words, man. They'll do that to you. You get what I'm saying? Because it's like I said, it's not polit uh, politically correct. You get what I mean? You know what I'm saying? They, they want to hear the, 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 the stuff that don't matter. So they'll judge you, man. They'll say you hate women. They'll say that they'll name you all these types of things. They'll even bring up false allegations, man. They'll make three minute clips of you. Taking, taking your stuff that you said out of context, which they do all the time. But they'll never watch a full video. Why? Right? They'll never watch a full video of you explaining who you are and explaining your agenda. They'll, they'll never, they'll never, they'll never do that. You know why? Because people, people have to feel like they're doing something right all the time. That they're not wrong at all. They don't need to be held accountable for anything. They're perfect. People have to feel like that. People don't want to look into the stuff that they need to do. So that's why some of these channels don't, they don't, they don't, you know, uh, they don't come up big because people don't like it. Bro, people don't like this, bro. People do not like listening to the truth. They don't. It takes a person that like, it takes some willpower to like go against your fears, bro. It does, man. No cap. And most people, mo most people's fears, man, they, it, conquer it conquers them. But man, that's it for the video, man. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. You mean, like the video, dog. Comment, whatever. Listen, man, I appreciate you guys for watching the vids, man. I really do. And subscribing to the channel, man. I've been getting a lot of feedback, dog. Continue, you know, continue doing what y'all doing. I'm going to continue doing what I'm doing, fam. Real talk. All right, man. I'm going to holler at y'all. Peace.